And it looks like the offensive line is shuffling around yet again. Well, it's uh, it's been pretty steady the last couple of days. Okay. Um, so I think it's starting to uh, starting to steady itself a little bit. And you know, I think uh, Victor and Isaiah at the tackles is is a good combination, and uh, uh, Fry has been kind of a constant in there. And then you know Ryan and Kyle are are, are getting better every day. So. We're seeing if we're starting to get some consistency with the lineup. And I saw Davis at tackle. Is that where? He's in there some. He's He's been flopping around between tackle and center. Uh, okay. the, the tilted technique that we play right there allows us to be a little more aggressive on the base blocks because mm -hmm. we're attacking a little bit more. Uh, allows us to play on the down blocks a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. uh, right. Coach Roy Tesh, our D-line coach, is, uh, has been playing the tilt for ever since we've been together, which mm -hmm. is uh, going on almost a decade. So mm -hmm. uh, he's, a, he's a great, great coach at uh, teaching that technique, you know, without uh, without getting them reached, which that's the, the danger of it. I love it because from last year, we, was, we weren't tilted, mm -hmm. and it was harder to, um, like if they came and reached block you or any, any type of block, mm -hmm. it was way easier for them to get with the tilt technique, you know, it's, it's more of a get after it, you know. You read the, after you read the linemen, it's much easier to read because you can see them better. And I came in, I wasn't the strongest, but then, I mean, I kept working with Coach D and, I mean, all the techniques he got, he's, a, he's big on technique and your technique and your form, and it just helped me push up more weight and he putting more body mass on me.